welcome back guys so this is section 4.4 and uh, from here we will start the boolean analysis of the logic circuits okay so we have different logic circuits which we have covered in our theory section here to what we have to do this is question number 12 and we have to write the boolean expression for each of the logic gates in figure 4.56 so this is 4.56 and in part a b c d we have uh, different circuits uh, which are known from the theory that which of them is uh, which of the circuit so using the a here here we have uh, the two inputs a b while this circuit this is called and okay so what we have to do we have to write the expression for x so let me use this x for it so x is equal to a multiplied by b because that is the and gate okay which is clearly shown by the gate which is here just like it okay so that is what that is a that is b that is x so that is the and circuit similarly for part b here we have this circuit okay so for part b we can see that we have one input one output and here we have this bubble so therefore x is the complement of a and that is basically the not gate okay and this bubble basically shows us the complement uh, operation which has been performed here and that is the essence of this uh, not gate or inverter uh, part c here is what is this this is basically another type of circuit and we have seen in our theory section that this is called or gate so what is the or gate the per procedure or the mathematical operation performed here is just like the inputs are added together and that is due to this or operation which is due to this or gate okay so we have previously seen that its symbol is just like this where this is the output and here we have the inputs a and b okay uh, similarly part d here is we have three inputs here we can see that and the same uh, circuit here we have this one and this one these two are basically the two same circuits so therefore what we have to do we have to uh, write here that the output is the sum of a plus b plus c and that is also the or gate okay uh, so that is the solution of our question and we have solved it we have seen that uh, what are different gates and what are their uses for different uh, inputs okay so in our upcoming section we will also try to solve more about uh, them till then take care of yourself and i will see you soon